Hey everybody, welcome to Seaside Quilting Supplies. Look who's here with me today. It's the princess. Um, Mary's not here today. And Carrie Lynn and I thought in honor of our massive snowstorm here in Virginia yesterday. Right, Carrie Lynn? Yeah, it was a, it was <laughs> it was shocking. We had like I don't know. It snowed for five minutes. We had like <clears throat> it was still nice though. A dusting of snow on the ground and then literally like it was gone before like, like tw 20 minutes. It was gone in like 20 minutes. It was just gone. It was mm. the saddest little snow you've ever seen. So for those of you who are getting tons and tons of snow, we're, you know, we're a little jealous. It's just cold here and that's all. Look y'all, she did my hair. We're by ourselves. Oh, she, no, here we are. Look, well, I curled it. She, she curled my hair look, like hair. hers. Look at her all waving. It doesn't look as good as hers, but yeah. She's all waving think? today. She's a she's our princess. All right, so we just wanted to hop on. So the the not massive snowstorm I was being facetious um, made us think about some of our beautiful snowflake fabrics. And Carrie Lynn said, "Why don't we do our plum pudding winter fabric?" So that's what we're going to do real quick. Um, we're going to do just eleven dollars a yard today, you guys, for Island Boutiques. It was a collection called Plum Pudding. It's a beautiful kind of a frosty. Hey, Laurel, happy Friday to you too. Um, everybody, say hello to Carrie Lynn. Carrie Lynn's here with us. Um, uh, eleven dollars a yard, and we just pulled a few kind of snowy, wintry, frosty things from Plum Pudding. Hey, Ginger, how are you? All right, so we're going to get to it. We're not going to be on long because Carrie Lynn and I are cutting and packing like crazy people here today um and let's see um okay so if you're new and you stumble across this live you can shop this live until sunday at 5 p.m eastern hey lita oh hey listen you guys don't forget to check that book post i almost sold out of those books before they got here you I guys you see that mm -hmm. um <laughs> Mary, <laughs> Mary, <laughs> Mary, <laughs> Mary, I'm going to ban you from your own place of employment. <laughs> You're going to get banned. Hey, Paula. Um, so please go back and look at that post. I did quick add on to my order with um, Fabric Cafe yesterday, late in the day. So I, I do have a few more. Um, so be sure you get Fat Quarter Treats or the Kids Three Yard Quilt Book, which I that think is going to be so much fun. I saw that. I, I know. That I thought maybe existed. you could make a th that, Kids That three would yard be quilt. what I would probably start with. Because mm -hmm. Carolyn's next on the I've Got to Learn to Sew <laughs> list. So, all right. So go back and look at the Fabric Cafe post with the two new um, Three Yard books in it and the Fat Quarter book. And um, I should have said the Fat Quarter book and the kids' book. There's not a new Fat Quarter book right now. I mean, a new three-yard book. I can't get my words out. Um, all right. So what else do I need to tell you? Um, look, Mary, she did my hair with uh, the look, curlers. Mary, I you put curlers it. in her hair this morning. I put, it was very curly. I'm going to make her let me do it with the curling iron because I think the curling iron will hold, will make it curly. I feel like it's curling It is. Oh, it does, because mine does too. Yours looks better. No, mine's, that's because mine's an actually a fuzzy mess. All right, so uh, $11 a yard for Plum Pudding Batiks today, and we're gonna just show you the ones we pulled real quick, and I think we pulled some really cute ones. So, Carolyn uh, was the inspiration for this. Let me see if we can get them all in the shot. All that. Uh, yes, that is all that. All right, so. And we're going to bring these up closer to you in just a minute. <clears throat> so these are beautiful plum puddings. This first one, I this one I think is gemstone. Look at these snowflakes. Look at, oh my gosh, look at that. Isn't that beautiful, Carolyn? Hold that side up. And that's bit. from the collection In the Mist. Oh yes, these are, Carolyn's right. Look at her fix, fixing me all up. <laughs> these are In the Mist by Hoffman, but they look so beautiful with our plum puddings. We it, added them here. So this color is called gemstone, and it's these Big, beautiful, wintry snowflakes. Just gorgeous. $11 is a steal for this Hoffman Boutique. You guys, McKenna Ryan Boutiques are about $15.50 a yard now at most shops. $11 today. Um, this will be number 192. Oops, let me get us a page for a little pop-up. <clears throat> hey, Mary, did the text message, did the text thing work, you guys? Is that what got you here? Did you guys all get a, the little text alert? We're still playing with that a little bit. Can I have a pen, Carolyn? Number 192 is the gemstone snowflake from Into the Mist. I wrote down $11. Oh, good girl. And I'm going to staple that right there. 
All right. Next to, yes, great. That's awesome, you guys. All right. So we put, I put the morning mist beside us and look. Look at it, those together. Look at these snowflakes and this. Pull it together. up here so the camera, Carolyn, and put them. Isn't that pretty? And this is by Toscana. That's Northcott, Toscana. Northcott, Toscana. Yep. yep. And look at those together. Aren't they gorgeous? What a great little two pack this would make. Just a super sweet little wintry bag or. I just, I don't know. I just love those together. I was so happy when Carolyn suggested that one. All right. So Carolyn's morning mist pick from Northcott will be number 178. You know how we like to reuse numbers, Carolyn, but we shouldn't do. Number 178 is the Toscana morning mist. Just $11 a yard today for that as well. <clears throat> and beside that, we put the snowflakes. Oh, the text worked great. Oh, great. Super, Patty. Nice. Thank you. Next to that, we put the pewter um, snowflake. So it's a little more gray. A little. Let me put this beside it. You can see the gemstone has a little bit more purple. of a purple, yeah. like in the background. And in that shot, especially, look right there. You can see the kind of the aqua relief. These are cuddle. I mean, these, these are, are batiks. Yeah, these are cotton batiks, Joanne. Sorry, we should have said that. These are all cotton. Um so this is the pewter. So it's more like a stormy gray background. Isn't that and pretty? Isn't it gorgeous? And the relief is more like a very pale, misty gray with sort of a hint of aqua. Sort of a hint of aqua. So this color is pewter. And it will be number 179, just $11 a yard today. And with that, we put the snow color. It's called snow. And it's really pretty. It's a Hoffman. It's a Hoffman watercolor maybe no it's an ombre so that's, that's an, a whole oh, yeah, yeah. because look yeah so look carolyn's gonna unfold it open it up carolyn and then kind of scrunch it together flip it let's flip it over yeah so then do a scrunch like so they can see a little bit of each color yeah like that um isn't look at that hoffman snow with this isn't it gorgeous Put this side down just a smidge. There you go. So then you can see so this is an ombre this snow is an ombre it goes from a very light it's a true ombre. That means it runs selvage to selvage, light to dark. So this selvage is very light, would pick up the relief just beautifully. And then as Caroline lets it fall down here a little bit, you'll see you get a little more into the gray aqua feel. And then at this selvage, you're going to get the gray, the aqua, kind of the smoky gray, taupey feel. I just think these are beautiful together too. Mm -hmm. So this is the pewter snowflake. This is the Hoffman ombre snow and we only have maybe three or four yards of that left uh number 528 for the hoffman uh snow ombre number 528 just 11 dollars a yard that's hoffman ombre snow we have about four yards of that ombre <laughs> snow left. hey diet how are you my dear um, next to that is the lilac berries. The lilac berries from Plum Pudding. And listen, we do only have about two, maybe there's two and a half yards of this left, and it is a really sweet little lilac background. It's got purple. Hold, Lots your, of purple hold that up there, Carolyn. And... Hold it nice and tight. There we go. Yeah, so in the background, there's like lavenders. There are some veins of darker purple. There's like a taupey color, but it's a little tiny. Hey, Marion, how are you? Oh, that's a good shot, Carolyn, right there. Um, see the dark purple veins in there and the taupey color? And the little lilac berries are in kind of a very pale, almost white relief, the little dots. We only have about two and a half yards of this one left. The lilac berries will be number 106. And they look like snow. I mean, they look like little snowflakes in they a do. stormy sky. Um, I cut these all the time on Etsy, and um, so they're probably going to be gone soon, if not today. All right, and up next is the beautiful whipped cream snowflake. snowflake. Hey, Jane Fox, how are you, my dear? Um, hey, Jane, I promptly ordered that kids that three-yard kids book. Did you see that? Almost sold out of it yesterday. I had to order some more real quick. Um, sold out of it before it got here, Jane. This is the whipped cream snowflake from Plum Pudding, and in the background is like this beautiful stormy, Kind of a stormy sky feel. Let's see if we can get some purples in there. Oh, like right there. There's a little pop of a purple vein. And, the, and these are scattered all behind the snowflakes. A little bit of a sagey feel to the background. Um, these are the whipped cream snowflakes. Hey, Becky, how are you, my dear? Good to see you. Hope you all are having a great Friday. This is number 155. 
This is the whipped cream snowflake uh, from Island Boutiques. The collection was called Plum Pudding. This is number 155, just $11 a yard today. So um, I just want to show you guys these side by side. Um, and we're going to add one more in just a second that I think would make a stunning three-yard quilt. And we do only have about two yards of this one left. Hand me that papyrus, Carolyn. So I picked this papyrus, and I know in the photo that I sent in the text, it looked like it got a little yellow, but I promise in this whipped cream snowflake, there there's is... a little bit of tan yeah. that pops out. And there's a little, a great little taupey color, just like Carolyn just pointed out. And this papyrus picks it up just perfectly. Let me get a white card on this. Let's put this one up here closer. So it's like just a barely a, um, like an antique sort of white. It's really just a beautiful, beautiful piece of fabric. Um, but it looks so pretty with these three. It would just make a gorgeous, soft, yummy um, three-yard quilt. You know, since we're all about getting those three-yard quilts cranked out, that'd be so pretty. So we have just about two yards of the papyrus left. And that will be... Number 284 will be the papyrus, and that's a Hoffman Batik as well. That's papyrus number 284. And, oh, next is the, these are called triangle trees, and of course they're Christmas trees. Um, and they're, they are um, all kind of all shades of lavender and taupe and a little sagey, and it's so hard for the camera to pick them up because they're so soft. But I think in that shot right there, you get a little bit, oh, let me go down here, a little bit of the green, 284 papyrus. Um, probably, Diet, yes. Um, let, I'll check on that for you. Oh, I keep going to the wrong place in the camera. So right in here, you can see like the little bit of purple and lavender, and up here is a little bit of a, a hint of green in that tree. So these are rows of trees. They are lined up very geometrically on uh, across the width of the fabric. <clears throat> the trees are about an inch tall and just a smidge over an inch wide. Jan, I'll let you know, okay, honey? Um, and um, it almost looks like they have watercolor. It there. does. They're very soft, kind of a washed watercolor feel. All right. These are the... Um, and this is by Plum Pudding. Uh, this is well. Plum Pudding. That's right. I have brain cramp there. This is the Plum Pudding Trees. Number 174, just $11 a yard, is Plum she Pudding Trees. Yards. I'll have to call about that because I probably don't have that. That's all. Oh, no, I know we don't have it. I'll have to see if I can get some more. Um, 174 was the Plum Pudding Trees. Just $11 a yard. And last but not least is, I think this one is called, it's called Storm. Storm. This, this is, might be my favorite. <clears throat> this is the Storm Snowflake. This background is, I don't know, violet maybe, Carolyn? What would you say? Purple with violet? It's got and some blues in it. And it does. It's it, got some pink that pops out of the snowflakes. It's really pretty. It does. It has a lot of colors. So you could take this and like pick out one of the navy veins or pick out some of the purple spots. Um, pull out the lavender even some the relief is in sort of an aqua I know it looks really gray right there you guys but let me get close and see if I can show you I know, this camera's not giving it well these are it's hard on these because they're so faint they're so pretty though. so you can see that the relief is a little bit aqua-y right there in the snowflake so it's like a gray aqua really pretty this is uh plum pudding snowflakes in storm it will be number 590 590 hang on Jane I'm going to read your comment she did a three-yard quilt for kids. Oops. Good grief. You can look at my hair now. That's a terrifying thought. Um, wow. Yeah, they look really great. I can't wait to get the book so I can go through it myself. And, um, you know, Mary's got, Mary's got a new grandbaby um, from just last weekend, I think. And... Uh, you know, as soon as we get her done with this placemat set, she's um, her husband's already got her lined up to make quilts. I don't know how that's going to go just yet, <laughs> but but that's that's what's on her schedule. So, all right, you guys. So, um, Plum Pudding Boutiques today, just eleven dollars a yard. You can shop this sale until they sell out or Sunday at five p.m. Eastern. 
All you need to do to order is tell us which ones you liked and uh, how many of them you would like and send us a message in chat with that information. And if you're brand new to us, send us your email address as well. You've been watching Seaside Quilting Supplies. I'm Barb. This is the Sweet Princess. And um, we'll see you on Tuesday with our next regular regular Facebook Live, Tuesday night, 7 p.m. Eastern Time. Um, and you never know what you'll see on our lives. No, really Thank you guys for joining us today. Have a fabulous weekend. Go sow some love and spread it around. The world surely needs it. We love you guys. Talk to you Bye. soon. Bye.